Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about the symbiotic relationship called commensalism. Commensalism occurs when one organism benefits from the relationship and the other organism, for the most part, is unaffected. Let's look at a couple examples to help us get a better understanding of commensalism. Up first are cattle egret and cows or bulls. The cattle egrets like to follow the cows along because the cows stir up insects from the grass. The cattle egret eat the insects and the cows for the most part are unaffected. Orchids are a type of flowering plant that like to make their base or attach to the branches of trees. They benefit by getting sunlight and then the tree for the most part is unaffected. The remora, also called sucker fish, are small fish that like to attach to sharks. They don't really harm the sharks and they get a free mode of transportation, a little bit of protection, and then pick up some scraps of food. The burdock seeds of, are shaped in which they attached to passing animals or even your clothing if you pass by. They don't really hurt the animal that they attach to and they get seed dispersal. And finally, barnacles and whales have a similar relationship. The barnacles can stick themselves to whales the whales don't really notice that they're there and the barnacles get a good free ride and also get some nutrition from the floating plankton that passes the well. So there we go, a couple examples of commensalism. One organism benefits and the other organism, for the most part, is unaffected. Thanks for watching and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please.